Hey everybody, it's Todd from Mountain 66 Diecast. What's going on? I'm coming to you from my backyard. Um, we just got back, my wife and I. And, uh, well, look at here. Hang on, let me... Sorry, I had to wipe the lens a bit. Got a couple pedal cars. So we're going to start off here with this one on the table. I just finished cleaning this up. Now this is a IGA livery. Now this is a grocery store franchise over here in Canada. I don't know if it's in the States or not. I'm not 100% sure. But anyway, Foodland. Now this one is from the early 90s. And uh, so it's got all the hubs. I, I, I tighten up the hubs again. I am missing, well we'll go around here to the back. Well, we'll get there. We'll get there. It's got the window, all the wing nuts. I tighten the wing nuts up. Clean the window. Steering wheel had to tighten up that nut. Here's the instrumentation. Okay. Yeah. Now I've got the sticker here. Made in China, so, but this is an early 90s one, I believe. The same with the guy that I bought it off. Of. He thinks it's a late 90s, or... Sorry, early 90s or maybe late 80s, like 88, 89, around there. That product very well could be. So this is pretty nice. I just cleaned this all up because they are going to go in the house. But as I said, I'm missing that center hub. Now, it does have some pinstriping. Missing some pinstriping in that here. Uh, here as well. I could, I could do something maybe with that, but... I don't know, but now I am probably going to fix this one spot. Someone hit it with some paint here. It looked like it some rust. Now I checked it. didn't go all the way back through. You see? So I might just sand that down a little bit, hit it with a little bit of primer, and just fix this hit white here. I don't know yet. Let's see. I don't like touching them because I'd rather get them just the way they are. I don't want to do too much to them. See? Pretty nice. That's the only blemish on it. Now I've cleaned up there, see, I've cleaned up the, you know, the, the red, red cap, I've cleaned it up, the glass, I've cleaned it all up. The grill's pretty nice on this. I've cleaned all the wheels because I don't want no dirt and mud on the floor or anything. The wheels cleaned up pretty nice. Yeah, and I'll have a quick look here. See inside, all nice. This is still a kick-ass car. Now incidentally, I bought that pedal car I showed four or five weeks ago. I got that. I got these from that guy. He recognized me and he asked me. He says, "Hey man, he says, uh, what'd you do with that other pedal car you bought?" And the, I said, "Well, I said it's in my car room." And uh, he's all oh, right on. So he says, "Well, I tell you what. Now I'm going to show you the tracker here." He says, "He says I'll give you a good deal here on these two. He says I don't, I don't want to store these for the winter again." Because our garage sale season's done at, right after um, uh, Thanksgiving, right? Our flea markets and that are done by after Thanksgiving. So I said, well, so he did. My wife was in for it too. So I'm going to show you here. Look at that little tractor. I've cleaned it up. Okay. This has been cleaned from top to bottom. I clean them from top to bottom. Now, this, I know these pedals are aftermarket. But that's all right. That I can live with. Now this has got a chain in it, more pretty similar to a bike. The gear, the sp or the sprockets and that are in there. And now this, now this turns as well. See? 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 Pretty cool. Now my grandparents were farmers. Now we, they had a tractor similar. With a one, like with the little two wheels in the front. Now this one's only got one, but I've drove a few of these old tractors in real life. Garden. Now we figure, I figure, we figure this is probably the 60s. You've got the exhaust. Still original seat. Wheels are. Now someone welded. Something, but he welded something on there, the nut. So this wheel must have come off at one point. I looked at it. I couldn't. Can't. I'm just going to leave it. 
and uh, man, I'm happy. I'm absolutely stoked. I've cleaned these from top to bottom. There's a little, there's something where you can mount, you know, hook pull a little wagon or whatever. I'm going to look into the garden, see if there's any little trailers or whatever, hay wagons or something that came with it. But anyway, so, well, I don't know. I think I did all right here. Now I've got three of them. <laughs> yeah, we might, might have to get someone to plan an interference. Anyway, all right, that's going to do it for me. Take care. Thanks for watching. See you soon.